Hi children, welcome to Narayana online classes. Let us discuss assignment of 6th class physical science. Topic is units and measurements. Okay, then. first question we discuss here change in velocity is. Change in velocity is. Okay, then. change in velocity is. So, change in velocity means you know everyone. So, when the vehicle is travelled from one point to another point, it can change the velocity. Means first point to second point. First point is the initial position or initial point of velocity and second point is the final. So, that's why you can change in velocity is called final velocity, final velocity minus initial velocity is called change in velocity is called change in velocity next go with another question magnitude of velocity is magnitude of velocity magnitude of velocity means we have discussed already velocity is the vector quantity velocity is the vector quantity it have both the magnitude and direction but they are asking only magnitude of velocity means speed Magnitude of velocity means speed. Why? Because speed have scalar quantity, it, it have only magnitude, no direction. So that's why magnitude of velocity is equal to speed. Is equal to speed. So next question. A body moves with a speed of 10 meters per second due east. After 10 minutes, it moves with a speed of 5 meters per second due west. The change in velocity of body during this time interval is so now we are discussing about change in velocity so change in velocity what is the formula of change in velocity means here final velocity minus initial velocity final velocity minus initial velocity first it go with due to east how much 10 meter per second 10 meter per second and after 10 minutes it come back to back center called west with 5 meter per second it is a forward direction east is the forward direction west is the backward direction so that's why final velocity final velocity is a backward to initial so that's why here it is a minus 5 okay minus 10 so totally minus 15 meter per second change in uh, velocity is minus 15 meter per second so next continuation what is the velocity of the particle whose initial position and the final position is same okay then. so what is the definition velocity equal to velocity definition equal to change in displacement change in displacement by change in time or time interval so now it is the displacement uh, x final minus x initial by t final minus t initial but x initial equal to x final means initial position equal to final position so that's why velocity is equal to is equal to zero is equal to zero why because x initial equal to x final so these two are equal that's why it is zero total velocity is equal to zero 